Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having an awesome day so far. It's Memorial Day weekend and the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day to be alive, okay? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. This is like perfect riding, riding, <laughs> riding weather. It's in the 80s. It's so nice. We got a nice little breeze here. I'm happy. I'm in my happy place. But I'm going to cut to the chase. Actually, I hope you guys are all having a great day and a great weekend so far. Now I'm going to cut to the chase. I know in my last video I mentioned I wanted to do a giveaway for you guys because I hit a thousand subscribers. I finally figured out what it is I want to do for my giveaway. Let's see if they wave. Oh, they did. Um, okay, so I figured out what I wanted to do for my giveaway. I want to give away gift cards, gift certificates, whatever you want to call them, to motosport.com. Um, which if you haven't heard of motosport.com, they're this fun little website that has all kinds of parts for your bikes and they have gear and helmets and accessories and basically anything you can need for your bike or yourself, they will probably have it. They have a good wide variety of brands. Oh, so I like them. I've never had a problem with their shipping. It always gets there when it says it will be and customer service has also been great. So I like them. Anyway, so I'm going to be giving away three $50 gift cards to some lucky winners out here. Um, and those will be sent to your email. So to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is click the gleam.io link, which is down in the description box. And I'll make it really big and obvious, something like, hey, enter the giveaway here. So click that link. It's going to take you to another website where you can enter. Like, I think I made it so you can enter eight times. Um, but it's like, you know, subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, whatever. So just stuff like that. It's really easy to enter. And again, I'll be sending the gift cards to your email. Um, it's going to be open for two weeks. There's no age restriction. Just make sure that if you are under 18, you have like parent permission, guardian permission, all that good stuff. So it doesn't look like some weirdo is just sending you, you know, random gift cards. Because we don't want that. We don't want people to think I'm a creep. Um, and yeah, that's all you got to do. So I hope that I made that an easy enough explanation. I'm not the best multitasker here. Hopefully I didn't leave out too many details. And that's the giveaway. So again, thank you so much for a thousand subscribers. Who would have thought that I would have got there? That's kind of funny, kind of crazy. I wasn't imagining it. I just kind of wanted to make this YouTube channel so I can document me riding my little Ninja 300 and learning how to property ride this thing. But yeah, so thank you guys. Me and the Moto King are just out catching some wind, having a good time. We might stop for lunch somewhere, I'm not really sure. And uh, that's about it. We're going downtown Geneva, baby. I wonder if they have anything open. Supposedly Chicago or the Chicago suburbs at least are gonna be able to open up like outdoor patios for restaurants in the end of May or beginning of June. I'm not really sure which it is, but that's something but you still can't really go in and sit down and have a meal like you used to but then again i have no business doing that right now I'm trying to be fit I'm trying to live my best life geneva is such a fun little town they have so many cool like art shows and craft show not i shouldn't say craft and art but they do have those but they have like um the french market they have all these cool summer activities that now we can't do which sucks because I always love, come, like this whole road will be closed off with vendors. It's awesome. They're cool to walk around. Got uh, some social distancing business going on. You going straight? Okay. Gia Mia. I've been wanting to try that place. For real. It's a pizza shop. Pizza shop? Pizza place? Pizza restaurant? Apparently they have like $7 pizzas or something on... I don't know, whatever day that day it is of the week that they have the special. But it's like, that's pretty damn good. I don't know if they're personal pizzas or like actual pizzas or what. But I would be more than willing to pay $7 for pizza. I've paid like $40 before. Did you guys ever do that thing when you were kids where you like held your breath all the way for the length of a cemetery? I did that once. My cousin told me about it. We're passing the cemetery and she was like, Shep, you gotta hold your breath. Oh, I thought it was gonna try and wheelie. This is a fun little mini golf course. We uh, frequent this place, I'll tell you that. There was one summer, I swear to God, we went mini golfing every week and just went around and 
did all the local mini golfing. But I'm gonna tell you this. The one time I started winning, he stopped keeping score. He does not like to lose. You know, I've never actually used the horn on my bike. <laughs> it's just not one of those things that I have uh, programmed into my thumb there where the horn is. Um, if you look just to the right here, that is actually a bicycle path that she should maybe get on. Girl, you're crazy. People tend to speed down these roads. It's just, you know, I wouldn't want to be biking on it. I always thought that was a Mexican restaurant. Turns out it's not. Commercial real estate is a business. <laughs> it's all right, I was close. Are you racing? That's right, I won. Oh, something smells good as shit over here. Biker gang going that way, you guys see that? Oh, that's nice. He has his helmet on the side of his bike. <gasps> That was a good surprise. Oh, look at that ice cream cone. Everyone, go eat at the Colonial Cafe. I haven't been there in 10 years, but it's fine. I wonder how this place is. This is a place I want to go. Restaurant and cocktails. Right up my alley. Yeah, ma'am, please. I'm gonna need you to stick to the, the rules of the road. kid was just hanging out what a life I would love to be pulled around by a bike honestly whoever wants to pull me around you can do it you'll get very strong legs there you go I can't really pretty dang good uh oh Speed wobbles. It's so funny on that little bike. I love it. Well, I have an embarrassing story for you guys. Yesterday I was out jogging and I fell. I fell right in the middle of a busy intersection, a very public intersection. My pride was hurting so bad. I was so embarrassed. I got up and I ran away. I cut my hand, not that you can see it. Cut my knee. And honestly, my, my like my lats and my shoulders are so fucking sore. I think it's just from falling and not expecting to have to basically pick myself back up super fast. So I'm like, holy shit. Is this what getting old feels like? Just kidding. I'm not I'm not old. I'm 24. Wow. Maserati. So the river does not normally come up this high. I don't think. Oh, I'm gonna beat his fucking ass, I swear to God. He's so funny. Yeah, that river is so flooded. I'm staying away from him. Splattering water on me. Do you think you're funny? <laughs> Try to do it again. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> the water get you or no? Oh, it sure did. Oh, it? it sure did. Seriously? Yeah. You little shit. Yeah, now look at you. Your pants are wet. <laughs> Got what you wanted? Yes. <laughs> well, anyway, you guys, if nothing else happens on this moto vlog, which it probably won't, I hope that you all have a great rest of your week, and I hope you guys have a fun holiday. Be safe out there and responsible. I'm just following him. And yeah, good luck to you guys who choose to enter the giveaway. Go for it. It's free. Free cash money. Well, not cash money, you know. Free gift card money. Hey, let me know if you have any questions. I'll be reading all the comments and replying to them. So yeah, I will catch you guys on the next Moto vlog. Can't figure out how to turn this thing off. <laughs>